We've been friends for over 12 years now. I remember meeting her when we played soccer together, but you remember it differently. Right? I remember, yes. I know we played soccer together, but I remember meeting each other at tennis camp very vividly. <laughs> <laughs> and that was before we started high school. So I have struggled with my own mental health for a long time now, um, and especially throughout my teens. I remember a time a few months ago when something had happened in my life and it was really affecting my me mental health. Um, I was really struggling and so I reached out to Tamara. The second she kind of sent me that text, was like, here's what's up, here's what's happening, I went, no problem. My best friend needs me right now, so you would do the same for me. I would. So. <laughs> we had actually already had plans to do something that day, but then we had to alter them because of what was happening with me and it was really great that she was able to be accommodating, and we ended up going for a walk. Tamara let me take my time in talking about it, and so we chatted and caught up and everything, and then eventually I was able to tell her what had happened and how it was affecting me, and I was able to get that support from her that I really needed. I just, I'm big on listening. And like that's kind of what I do. And I, I just try to listen and absorb as much. And then I'll speak. If you just sit there and if you just listen and then you think about what you're gonna say next, it's much more impactful that way. That's what I think. The biggest thing is just knowing that if I ever need her, she's there. I hope that she thinks, 100%. she knows oh my that goodness, yes. I'm there yes. for you too. <laughs>